The pandemic hastened the mass transition of company assets to digital environments. As this migration continues, these environments will be increasingly layered and complicated with more overlooked weak points and wider attack surfaces. The future is a tense battleground. Getting ahead is key. Always be prepared. Make it a habit to always expose weaknesses in your own IT infrastructures and conduct regular stress tests to gain hands-on training on simulated attacks. Because continued adoption and integration of new tools into the hybrid work environment will inevitably lead to the inconsistent application of cloud technology. The weak points that attackers will target could come from the lack of familiarity with new technologies, lack of bandwidth to oversee all cloud vendors, mixed vendor environment, misconfigurations from the user side, or security issues from the developer's side. Adopt the never trust, always verify principle. Verify everyone and grant only least privileged access. Allow authorized users a secure connection only to specific services that they need. Because as hybrid work environments become the norm, the enterprise perimeter will expand into the home. Office devices will be moving between corporate networks and the workforce's less secure home networks. And this is where attackers can strike and serious data breaches can happen. Train all your users to spot security red flags to avoid potential devastating attacks. Because social engineering based attacks, that's ones based on human error, will still be one of the most pervasive threats. Tried and tested tactics will keep spreading, like more complex romance and dating scams. Business email compromise will level up by using artificial intelligence and deepfakes to impersonate high-ranking executives to defraud companies. An SBOM is key to how enterprises practice software security and supply chain risk management. Check your software configurations periodically, ideally under an airtight vulnerability management plan, to up your defenses. Because attackers will take on existing weaknesses of enterprises and invade through cracks and attack surfaces like open source software. Failure to update outdated and insecure protocols and devices in enterprise networks could prove costly. Attackers will also target software construction and find ways to exploit vulnerabilities in the software's shared components. They will infiltrate popular off-the-shelf pre-built software components in order to pass off their malware as a legitimate code. Support the growing demand from further industry-wide national-level standards to harden OT infrastructures. Because as industrial companies invest in 5G and artificial intelligence to help their transition into the industrial Internet of Things, malicious actors will target as much emerging technologies as they can. This challenge will be heightened by a shortage in cybersecurity experts, who will have to manage the OT systems of multiple interconnected factories. Cybercriminals are looking beyond single organizations and targeting managed service providers and tools as a threat vector, giving them the power to strike at the infrastructure of multiple firms at once. The current point solution approach will not be enough, overworking security teams and exposing them to alert fatigue. To get ahead of the evolving threats that will rise in 2023, enterprises will need to ensure that they have the best practices laid out with a multi-layered defense plan that is built on extensive research and reliable insights of security experts. Learn more about Trend Micro best practices for 2023 at www.trendmicro.com.